Got a bit of recycling to do. Hello? Here you are. Thank you. So I just had a shower and used Alex's face wash on my skin and look at my forehead and look at my nose and my whole skin is like breaking out in a rash. I don't know what to do. I guess it's because I haven't used, if you follow my channel, I haven't used a um, soap, like a commercial soap or face wash in probably like a year or two. Like ever since I started No Poo, I've kind of gone on board with all natural products. As you know, I have a ebook on it. Um, but I've, I've run out of all my stuff because obviously I've been moving around so much and haven't settled in yet. And I've run out of my cleansing oil and um, the stuff that I need to make it again is at home in Cornwall. So I just thought, okay, my skin was really, really dry this morning because of the hard water here. And my, my scalp is really, really dry. Everything's just wrong. <laughs> and I thought I'll use the soap just to sort of get rid of all the dry, the dry skin and kind of just fresh my skin up because I feel like I haven't washed it properly in a while. I've been just washing it with water. And then this happens. So that's the last time that I use a um, chemical laden I know people say, oh, everything has chemicals in it. I know, I mean, nasty chemical laden uh, soap on my skin. Like I'm never, it just shows the effects when you go off of something. Um, so maybe consider giving up those soaps because this is what it does to somebody who hasn't used them in a long time. It's literally giving me a rash on my face. I think it's the areas that obviously are dry and I'm someone with normal skin or on the oilier side. So having dry skin at the minute is very bizarre. I don't know what to do. I was supposed to film a video for my channel and I can't really because I look like a beetroot. Send help. Two hours later. So we had to come to Costa because the internet at Alex's was not working and I have a video that has to go up today. So it is getting there, it's done 9 oh it's done 10% since we've got here. I tested the upload speed and it was 3.7 so it's quite fast. Yeah. So um, it should hopefully be done. And then we wanted to go to the cinema didn't we? We did. Yeah. So we'll have to see how this upload goes and if it does it in time. Uh, close call. <laughs> we can go to eat something. Maybe we can just eat, we can have our pizza in the uh, cinema like last time. No. <laughs> um, yeah, go, you're interested in this video, it's all about um, it's all about depression and anxiety. <laughs> Go watch it up here. <laughs> Just got to run to the petrol station because whenever you actually need to go somewhere, you always have zero petrol. Man, it's just in Costa, but if we can pull this off and get dinner and a cinema in, I think it'll be. on whether it's uploaded. Okay, so it's 27 minutes remaining, 79%, so. Not bad. Looking good. So the video is done, and um, I'm out of focus. And um, I'm really struggling to figure out what I want to eat. Alex hates me in this mood, don't you? I suggested three different meals, and they are all not suitable. I just don't know. And now we're going to Sainsbury's. Why did I put four up? I'm going to Sainsbury's now because I just don't know what I want. Because one of the options is noodles, and we had noodles yesterday. Where have you gone? Come in. Oh, and um, you the other option is burger, and we don't have burger buns, and I feel I don't want to buy burger buns because. Well. <laughs> and then the other option is pasta, and I don't want pasta. So I don't really know. I'm in one of those really fussy moods. It's like, I don't know if you girls get it. I, you it's can eat coming, anything. What would you it's eat? coming at the same time of the month, and I just, do you know what I mean? I get really fussy about food, and I'm really particular. <laughs> so we're gonna have a browse. I don't know if it's gonna be so much shopping time with Manny and Alex, but um, I might just buy some popcorn at the very least. <laughs> just be a bag of popcorn. <laughs> so we decided on burgers, and then we realised we didn't have cheese. And I said we should go to the Tesco. 
but Alex is saying no, he's saying it's five, ten minutes away. We're in Sainsbury's. <laughs> she wants to go to Tesco, the other side of town. Because they don't sell bloody vegan cheese in the Sainsbury's, even though Sainsbury's came out with their own line of vegan cheese, they don't sell it. It's in like a little Sainsbury's. It's not that little. It's so stupid. What? So you're, are you saying no to getting cheese? I'm saying no to the dress. <laughs> are you saying no to cheese? Or yes. yes to cheese. Just, we don't need cheese, we've got avocados. And but it was so good, it literally tasted like a Big Mac. It was good. We'll Didn't have it? other burgers in the future. Okay. <laughs> but it's just not going to be the same, Alex. <laughs> please, please, please. <laughs> so creepy. Can I try this one? <laughs> I said do something scary and he puts glasses on. Hello children. <laughs> so we found 20p rolls. What's the verdict on Tesco? We decided what Alex, the verdict was. No. This is what she the does. viewers want it. They want to go to another shop. <laughs> this is our carb filled yeah. shop. <laughs> Insert cash or touch, pay with card. It's the old one pound coin. Bye bye. I actually agree with that, like, because I started to think about, you know when you start to think about the process of doing something? She agrees with me. I started to think about the process of getting in the car, going to Tesco, going in the Tesco, going to the aisle of the cheese, and I thought, oh, I can't be bothered, because it's already like seven. So I thought, no, I'd rather just go home. And we do have hummus an avocado that we can put, which will probably be pretty delicious, which we didn't have in it last time, so. No, no cheese It's just that last time, we melted time. the cheese on it. The pulled pork burgers from Linda McCartney were literally so good, and we melted the cheese on them in the oven, and then put lettuce and tomato and ketchup, and it tasted just like a Big Mac, and I couldn't understand it. Um, so, I was craving that. And we've got some other goodies, maybe we could cook those as well. <laughs> My diet has turned to shit recently. Hello. Get the chips then. Oh! <laughs> what are you doing? Alex! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Alex! Ah! Ow! Why are you filming me? If there are two of, so we're having two of these. I'm on yeah. the floor because the freezer is on the floor and it's falling out and I'm trying to decide. So if we're having two of these, are you? what's that burger there? A nut cutlet. Why didn't you get me one? Because you said you didn't like them. Yeah, but you can have one if you want, I'm not stopping you. Should I have a nut cutlet or should I have two sausages for like a hot dog? Oh, two I'm sausages. Dog. Yeah, that's probably better. More suitable for you. I might as well shove these in because we need to eat these up. Yes. Okay. Healthy meal. That's milk, by the way. <laughs> Alex realised that he had some vegan blue cheese, which I think tastes like plasticine. So he's put it on his weird nut cutlet. So that's like my worst nightmare. But everything else looks pretty good. These burgers are the pulled pork ones and they, I can't but tell you how good they smell and taste. Just if you're new to veganism, get these. They are a dream. So this is behind the scenes of the health that I'm going through right now. Look at that. Like what have you done? Yeah, it looks like pork. You've scraped the bottom off. So here's the green part of the meal. And there is some fruit, veg. These vegetables. Alex has done the thing that I despise, <laughs> where he pours it all so it covers everything. This is how you do it. Even that touching that chip annoys me. But this is how you do it. Ah! Not like that. Stop it. Stop it. Oh. I'm trying to pick a movie. God help us all. This is like the worst thing. It's my pet hate is when you your food's ready and you haven't picked a movie yet and then you have to spend ages deciding what movie to watch and then the food gets cold or you eat it before you've watched the movie. And We're in the romance section and she still can't decide. 
Because I'm thinking of you. Because I would watch Phantom of the Opera or Moulin Rouge or Footloose or all these I've things. I've seen Moulin Rouge. But I'd watch Save the Last Dance. Oh my gosh, please can we watch Practical Magic if I can find it? You know how I really wanted to watch it when we were away? Yeah. Because it's Halloween themed. Or Hocus Pocus. <laughs> yep. No? You, you, I don't want to watch it if you want to watch it. Well, I'm going to hate whatever it is. So. No. No, no, because that takes the enjoyment. I only watch something we both want to watch. I don't really mind. Maybe I should watch that with my mum when I go home. Well, if they're actually good movies and not just... No. Yeah. They're the sort of movies, they're like cult movies. For like Halloween, but I don't think the Hocus Pocus or Practical Magic will rank very highly on IMDb. <laughs> so, I don't know. What's a genre that we both like? Uh, drama? Com I'm thinking action sci-fi. Most popular. That's a good place uh, to yeah. start. You'd think. Moola. I love how most popular is basically all Disney films. Look, it's basically Disney movies and then Superman movies. Superhero movies. And Alvin and the Chipmunks. We've decided on Rainmaker because the romance movies weren't that great a selection or I wasn't in the mood for them and Rainmaker... I feel like I've heard of it as like a classic film that I've never seen or at least <clears> I don't <throat> think I've seen it. A lot of the time I think I haven't seen something and then I put it on and then I immediately realise I've seen it. Really good 90s Matt Damon movies. Yeah. It's got Danny DeVito, oh. your favourite. Oh yeah. The Trash Man. I'm the Trash Man! <laughs> So Maddie has gone to get another spoon. <laughs> Why are you vlogging that? Because her first spoon wasn't adequate for her needs. Right, can I just show the guys something? Look at this spoon. Isn't it neat? Wouldn't you think my collection no. is complete? Okay, so look at this spoon, one of those old ones, really deep, and like one of these really old spoons, and compare it to this spoon, which is like a newer one. New from and JML. It's, and it's got like, a nice sort of smooth bit and it's like a, a nice new one. This one also tasted funny. Um, I don't know why. I'm really fussy about spoons it's because... the one I was cleaning my toes with. <laughs> because spoons make a difference how the food tastes. This is like really smooth. Alex! No! Mm. Alex, stop! Mm. 